another video. Thank you so much for being with us today once again. I would like you to drink this milk before you go to bed. And after drinking this milk, come back to the comment section and testify about it because you're going to enjoy this milk and it's going to benefit your body. So today's recipe, this time recipe is a wonderful immunity boost drink that will help to boost our immunity that will help to boost our health and this drink is good for everyone to drink drink it before you go to bed apart from boosting your immunity it's gonna help you sleep like a baby your body will be relaxed you're going to enjoy this drink and we have herbs this drink is all about herbs we are using herbs to bake this drink so without talking much the first thing we are going to be doing is i'm gonna put on the stove and i'm going to be adding milk the milk i am using today is almond milk if you see the seed you will know it's almond milk no matter it is written in deutsch Almond milk is what I'm using. You can use almond milk, cashew nut milk, coconut milk, oat milk. I do not use cow milk and I'm not advising you to use cow milk. This recipe is best to use plant-based milk. And plant-based milk will boost your health much more better because cow milk might make you have more mucus in your body so that's why i don't take it and it does it doesn't digest well in my body so that's why i use this one because i i get many questions should i use any other milk apart from plant-based milk but i'm advising you to use any of the plant-based milk you have and for the milk i'm going to be adding one and a half cups of this almond milk this is one cup and this is another half cup it depends on the size of cup you normally use to drink your milk my own consists of about one and a half liquid so that's why i'm adding one and a half liquid you can add one cup if you're okay with that so here we have our milk the first thing i'm going to be adding there in our milk is ginger this is the quantity of ginger i'm going to be using and i'm going to be grating it you can cut it you can mash it if you can because it's a hard something so the best way is to grate it so i'm grating it to get about a tablespoon a teaspoon of grated ginger that's what you will need for this measurement. And do not allow your milk to be on a high heat. You have to simmer it, not high heat, because what we are doing is to warm it up by adding other things in it. So I reduce the heat very low. Low heat is what you need for this. So in here we have about one teaspoon of grated ginger, fresh grated ginger. I wouldn't want you to use powdered ginger here. Grated one will be much better than the powdered one. And after that, the first thing, the next thing I'm going to be adding, sorry, is gloves. We all know that gloves is antibacterial help. It helps us to stand strong against bacteria, against infection. And for the glove, I'm going to be using about 10 gloves. And for the 10, for the gloves, I'm going to be like mashing it. A little bit if you have your mortar you can use your mortar i'm using this just to mash it so that it will infuse more 
in the milk. That's why I'm trying to mash it to break it down a little bit more. Here is my mashed glove, about 10 gloves. We don't have to drink our milk just that just like that mix all these things in your milk and you are increasing your health you're increasing your health situation so the next thing i'm adding here is turmeric here i'm using powdered turmeric if you have fresh turmeric that will do good if you don't have the fresh one you can use the grinded one like i am using and for the turmeric i'm going to be using one teaspoon of turmeric this is my teaspoon of turmeric and i add it to the milk this is a wonderful drink you drink it 30 minutes 45 minutes before you go to bed you believe when you do this almost every night for one week definitely you're going to enjoy you won't drink your milk another way this way is the way you're going to be drinking your milk whenever you want to drink your milk because i so much love drinking my milk this way so because of the turmeric to activate the turmeric in this we are going to be adding black pepper and here i have my black pepper so I'm going to be crushing in some black pepper in here. About, just like about one quarter, one quarter or one eighth of black pepper. I will put a I will put the measurement and the names of things I use on the description box after the video. So after the black pepper, the next thing I'm going to be adding here is cinnamon. Cinnamon, you can use the cinnamon powder. Here I have my cinnamon powder and it's organic. Or you're going to be using cinnamon stick. I've gotten so much, so many questions, people asking me if I don't have the stick, I don't have the cinnamon stick, what do I use? If you don't have the cinnamon stick, then you use the powder one. And that is the reason why I am using the powder one in this video. So I'm going to be adding, I'm going to be adding about half, half a teaspoon of cinnamon. To the saucepan this is half of a teaspoon if you are a lover of all these things i'm putting you will know that this drink is so beneficial to the body so so good for our immunity for our immune system i give it a stir i still have one more ingredient to put in this we are warming it up everything is combining together you know cinnamon takes time to combine with other things so make sure to mix well so that everything combines together while it is warming and getting ready to be taken to boost our immune system, to boost our immunity. So the next thing which I'm going to put here is nutmeg. I don't have the nutmeg, nutmeg seed. I would have shown you what nut, nutmeg is, but if you Google it, you will know what nutmeg is. If you don't know what it is, I have the powder nutmeg here. I'm just going to be adding just a pinch of nutmeg just a pinch i am using one one eighth of my spoon to measure the nutmeg so this is the quantity i am adding for the nutmeg this drink believe me is packed with lots of anti-inflammatory properties 
the turmeric is high in anti-inflammatory, the clove, the nutmeg, the cinnamon, all these things together will definitely boost your immune system. And drinking it with, with grated, grated ginger and plant-based milk you are giving your body the right food and you're going to relax while you sleep. You're going to sleep like a baby. Believe me, I'm talking from experience. I am talking from experience what I benefit whenever I drink this. So I'm going to allow it to simmer more for about two minutes. The total time for cooking this will be just five minutes and you are good to go to drink your wonderful milk your anti-inflammatory milk your immunity milk that will boost your immune system heal you you will hardly fall sick if you keep this if you keep drinking this tea you will hardly fall sick because they are packed with those goodies those nutrients those things that will help to make your body stand strong to fight against infections if you have cold this is good for you if you're feeling uh, you have cough this is also good for you so i'm going to allow it to simmer it's not supposed to boil it's just to simmer for one more minute if you have not yet subscribed, you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you find this video helpful or you have tried this milk before, don't forget to share with us on the comment section. Contribute for people that do not know about this milk. They didn't want to hear from you. They didn't want to know what they can benefit from it. Whatever that you have benefited from this drink, please don't forget to share it on the comment section. So, our drink is ready is what we did here is to warm the milk with all these herbs with all these good things ginger gloves turmeric black pepper cinnamon nutmeg just check check it out so the next thing i'm going to be doing is to strain it If you're good at drinking it and enjoying the things inside it, you can drink it like this. But if you're not good at drinking these roughage things inside it, then you can strain it. I'm going to be straining it now. I'm trying to get... My smaller strainer. So I'm going to be straining it. Okay, so here is my cup and here is the the drink. Draining it. Wow. And it is very creamy. It is creamy. Wow. And especially in this hot weather. We are in, I mean, especially in this cold weather, we are in a very cold weather now. This is what you need. Boost your immune system with this. Are you experiencing cough? Are you having flu? This is what your body needs. Make this milk and drink. You will feel better. If you have stuffy nose, this is good for you if you're having cough this is good for you drinking this will help you not to be falling sick all the time even if you're in cold weather people are complaining of 
cough, people are complaining of stuffy nose, you will not feel the same because this will help to relieve you and you're going to have a very good night rest. So guys, that's what I have come to share with you now. I'll allow it to cool off a little bit. Then I will drink, wait for 30 to 45 minutes. Then I go to bed. If you find this video helpful, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share with other people so that they can see it and also make and drink. This is good for everyone, a child, mother, father can drink this. So, thank you once again for joining us on today's live streaming. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you and may God continue to answer your prayers, give you all your hard desires and may all your hard work come out to be a successful one. Thank you and always remain blessed. Bye-bye for now.